When we had freedom, we could not value it. Now, since we don't have it, we crave for it, but get none. Then imagine the struggle of those unsung warriors who played such an essential role in the freedom of our nation. Today we share the story of warriors who fought with valor to save their motherland from enemies, but the heroic deeds remain unknown to many. Independence, the ongoing COVID-19 scenario has made us understand the importance of this word in its literal sense. Independence is not only a fundamental, but a birthright of every being on this planet. India, our motherland, has seen many attacks and attempts to disrupt its sovereignty by many rulers and countries. But India, our motherland, has had many brave sons and daughters, rather heroes and warriors, who with their bravery and valor have outclassed the enemies many a times. Today, we present a brief mention of a few such weaves who are not known to many and their stories of valor and bravery remain unsung. Venu Nakiyar was the queen of Shivaganga. Her husband Thevar was killed in a war with the British. In this war, Shivaganga was in an alliance with the Nawab. Soon, she escaped to the village of Virupakshi. I go in front of you. We will create an army against the Nawab. And after I have crushed him, I will revenge the death of my dear husband. Strategize the final attack on the Nawab and the British troops. While Nachir bravely fought, the British Army, the chief commander, Wheelie, died in an explosion by bombing the British camp, creating history by becoming the first suicide bomber of the world. Ram Prasad Bismil was a writer and revolutionary born in Shalapur, British India. He wrote the famous slogan, Sarfaroshi ki tamanna. He started working for the Manipur conspiracy in which he had to collect funds for his newly formed party against the British. Bismil absconded when he saw the police. He jumped into Yamuna to escape. He managed to stay alive and planned to plunder a train going to Lucknow which we popularly call Kapori Conspiracy. He was caught after this and put into the cellular jail until he was hanged to death. Sir Faroshi ki tamanna ab hamare dil mein hai Dekhna hai jo kitna baal hoi ka til mein hai Mein Ram Prasad Bishwil yeh pran leta hoon Ki jab tak is jism mein yeh lahu hai Mein desh ki azadi ke liye lartta rahun ga lartta rahun Nijanama was a brave queen who fought against the British to abolish the doctrine of lapse from her kingdom. When the queen of Kittu lost her son, and she was stepped into sorrow. But when her husband reminded her that even the people of Kittu were her children, then she pulled herself together and devoted her life to their well-being. I am not eager to plunge into a war with the British. I try for a peaceful settlement, but if we have to fight, fight we must. However, the British had more advanced weapons and military power. Therefore, she was deeply wounded and lost her kingdom and motherland heavily. She was finally taken into prison. When she was caught, she said, My only regret is that I couldn't die fighting on the battlefield. Chinamma was captured. While in prison, she used every moment to give statements demoralizing the British. She died five years later. Even to this day, the people of Kittur sing about their valorous queen who was among the first to resist British rule in 